NAMDEB continuously strives to ensure a safe and healthy workplace for employees through health monitoring and minimizing exposure that could lead to incidents. As part of living up to our value of safety and instilling a zero harm culture, alcohol testing was taken a step further in 2013 with the installation of alcohol testers in northern coastal mines, Orange River mines and recently southern coastal mines. In addition, this measure ensures that we comply with legislation by providing a safe working environment in our mining license areas. In an effort to gauge employees' opinions, we took a trip down to PCC recently and uh, this is what some of your colleagues had to say. I think it's a good thing. Um, it will prevent people from going to the mine under the influence of alcohol. Uh, I would say they are good, a good thing in a sense that they have uh, helped us as employees to uh, say keep away with the habit of uh, going into work under the influence and in so doing they have somehow had a positive impact on our financial uh, stability within the mining town and the safety at large of the company has gone up due to their presence. Uh, sometimes if you go in one cubicle, it will send you out, but if you go to the next one, it will, keep you, it will take you inside. Sometimes the system is not working nice. I think it's a very good thing. Um, that, that ensures that people that work in Southern Coast of Mine get to work fit for work. And that's a good thing. That's for the benefit of us all. And it gives the supervisors more time um, during the mornings to do what they must do instead of running around doing fitness for work testing. Okay, I think it's a good idea because we don't want, as we are saying, we don't want any unsafe activities on the mine. We think it's a very good thing because we don't want industrial people inside. I think the alcohol testing is a good initiative. Personally, um, I would want to, I would want to have assurance that I'm working on a mine with people in vehicles and machines that are sober. It's actually a good thing because then at the end of the day I'm secure that the colleagues and the people I'm working with aren't really under the influence of alcohol. Uh, my dear mother is a resident. Was I'm going to arm as a safety. And the red is safety. Safety belongs to us all. So the red line is as a bit dark also is mark. But the is red as well. Very dark in the day for I'm money. I think it's a wonderful system, it's state of the art and it's a great initiative especially in line with our safety policies to try and make the workplace safe for, for everyone and of course it has its limitations or a few disadvantages in terms of people complaining about hygiene or so but I think those are minor compared to the ultimate goal it's going to achieve so I'm really all for it, it's quite a wonderful system. Sometimes you are doing poly, it's not too much. When you enter there, it's recording you are not. Yeah. Then you are going to, to suspend it for the hearing. Then you get final for 12 months. Yeah. When you repeat again, you know those 12 months, sometimes you are fired. Yeah. The yeah, other side is good to, to prevent the people not to come to the work where you are drinking. Yeah. Yeah. Five Ambara, Iponga, Oya Shuna Pegi, Shonavari, Ambara Capena, Hambro Kurunga, Koshi, Yam, Ambara Mutuka, Chandita, when I say, Okuche, Mano Shirimano, Omega Munamba, Prove, Ashka Munoka, Okashe, Okafena, Oseko, Koshimo, Koshizemo, Yangon, Penoko, Afidiram, when I went to Ufidiremo, Nenobala Mashimo Koshia.
Yeah. The policy was basically set in place in order for, or rather for our protection, you know, uh, to prevent accidents that will occur, you know, when you are drunk or intoxicated at work. So basically this policy, it's a good thing. In other words, safety first, so. Well, there you've heard it, colleagues, straight from the horse's mouth, so to speak. About the concerns that were raised, it has been confirmed that extractive fans have been installed in the cubicles at PCC. Further, sanitary towels have been provided to sterilize the machines in question. It is a legal obligation to ensure that our mining operational areas are a safe environment and as such, no intoxicated persons shall be allowed to enter these areas. Town-based officers do not form part of this legislation, but because we are committed to safety across all our operational areas, we make use of handheld alcohol testers and random testing in town. Working under the influence of alcohol is not safe. Let's take responsibility and work safely.